What's up, family? A 10-year-old boy who shot and killed his 44-year-old mother in Milwaukee last week is being charged with first-degree homicide as an adult. What do y'all think about that, fam? Too harsh? Not harsh enough. Before you drop your comment, perhaps you'd like to hear the backstory here. So, according to the criminal complaint, the boy was allegedly mad at his mom for waking him up early and not letting him have something on Amazon. The fatal shooting took place near 87th and Hamlock around 7 a.m. on Monday, November 21st. Police initially reported the boy was playing with the gun when it discharged, striking his mom. The woman, identified as Quiana Mann, was shot in the head and died from her injuries. According to the criminal complaint, when the boy was first interviewed, he said he was twirling the gun around his finger and it accidentally went off. After killing his mom, the boy woke up his sister, who then found their mom dead and called 911. Due to his age, the boy was allowed to remain with his family. However, the following day, the family contacted the Milwaukee Police Department with serious concerns. His 26-year-old sister told the police that the boy has five different people inside of his head talking to him. She also said that He's had rage issues his entire life. A therapist gave the boy a concerning diagnosis and the boy's mother had placed cameras inside of the home to watch him. However, just two weeks before she was murdered, the cameras were turned off. This kid has some serious mental issues. The sister told detectives that she learned the morning after her mother's death, get this fam, this is cold bloody. The boy had logged on to his mother's Amazon account and ordered an Oculus virtual reality headset. He just killed his mom over this headset that she told him that he couldn't have. And he still went back the next day and ordered the headset. The complaint also says that a family member alleged that the boy would grab the family dog by the tail and swing it around until the dog would moan and squeal. They also said that the boy once filled a balloon with gasoline and set on fire a sectional and part of the carpet inside of the house. Now, the boy said, confessed to his aunt that, first of all, he lied. First of all, he said it was a pure accident. He was twirling the gun around and the gun went off and he shot his mom. Then he said in the second interview that he aimed a gun at his mom. Uh, he aimed a gun at the wall. He was, wasn't trying to shoot his mom. He was just trying to scare her. And he shot and then he hit her. Furthermore, an aunt told detectives that the boy never cried or showed remorse after killing his mom. The complaint alleges that the 10-year-old boy told his aunt that he actually tried to kill his mother. He actually aimed the gun at his mother and squeezed the trigger. The complaint also says that he told detectives that he understood that if he squeezed that trigger, that guns do kill people. So they're saying that he knew that, yeah, if I shoot her, she could die. We'll come back to that in a, in a minute. The aunt told detectives the day after his mother's death, he apologized for killing his mom and get this fam. Then asked the aunt, has my Amazon package arrived? 
This sounds like the work of a, you know, a 30-year-old sociopath, 40, 50. But he's 10 years old. And I don't think he should be tried as an adult. This kid needs to be put in a mental hospital. He needs therapy. Sending that boy to prison is not going to make him a better person. It's not going to protect the community. It's not going, definitely not going to protect him. He goes into a penitentiary where they put him in a juvenile first. And when he turns 18, that's when they'll send him to the prison. But it don't work out for these kids when they go to prison that early. It don't work out for them. When they become a man in prison, all you're around is a whole bunch of nonsense and a bunch of dudes who made mistakes and who are in jail still making mistakes and plan to make more mistakes when they get out. Damn, are those really mistakes? I guess not. But anyway, fam, I don't believe that this kid should be tried as an adult. We all know why. Because he's black. That's why they're trying him as an adult. That's why they want to try him as an adult. At least he's supposed to meet with a judge next week to determine if that truly is going to happen. But I don't know, fam. Um, this is a very, very sad case. And there's other cases out there like this where parents have denied their children something, some type of privilege or whatever, and the kids have killed their parents. Like, whatever happened is just taking your punishment. Whatever happened is just working your way back into the good graces of your parents so they can do something nice for you. Whatever happened to that? Oh, man, we so far off, man. I'm going to tell you something, fam. I'm cool with whatever go down if it was just me. But I got these kids I brought into the world. And I just want them to have a good life. I want them to have a, you know, as many good days as possible. I don't want to leave this world in a in the torn position that it is right now. And it's it's really damaged bad. And I hope things will turn around just for them. Cause I can, I'm okay. I'll be all right no matter what. You know, I done done my work, you know, I got more work to do. But if it stopped today, man, I'm cool, you know. But, you know, it's not just my kids either. It's my homeboy kids, my, my brothers and sisters' kids, my cousins' kids, my friends' kids, and kids that I don't even know that got that sparkle in their eyes, and they just want to live life to the fullest. Man. But this kid, um, he's going to miss that. He's going to miss all the graduations. He, he may even miss having an opportunity to get married and have children. He's pretty much throwing it away. But they're trying to do him bad. They're trying to do him dirty. They're trying to throw him away, I do suspect, because he's black. And that is the only reason why. But anyway, fam, y'all drop a comment and let me know what y'all think about this. No more talk. What, what, what the haters talking about?